you may not realize it, but you are sacred. Add your voices! Cosmic vibrations flow through your being. Daughter, hand me the final prism. Take your place. Where has she gone? Find her. Bring her back to me. Now! We are doomed without her. Kim. Hi, this is Kim. I may be off the grid right now. Please leave a message after the beep. Hey, Kim. It's me. Jess. Maybe we should talk about, you know. So, yeah. That thing you mentioned? The retreat? I'm in. Beautiful. We've got a ways to go until camp. Let's talk on the way up. 
Come on. We've got a lovely hike to get to the retreat. Hike? I thought this was supposed to be relaxing. You'll be fine. It'll be good for you. So, I guess I know why you invited me. I appreciate you coming, Jess. We have a lot of history, you and I. Yeah. I haven't thought about it for a long time, but you always carried it with you. I did. But I'm finding a way to move on. I guess this place really helped you. Honestly, for the first time in my life, I feel whole. Tyler is so inspiring. I'm happy for you, Kim. I'm telling you, Jess, being here is going to change your life. Let's hurry up. There's something I want to show you. This way. So what's Tyler like? Tyler is like no one I've ever met. He's a very special teacher who has such depth. He really understands me. Right. And what's with the clothes? We wear all white to help us focus on our unique energy. We have some for you back at the camp. Hannah! You must be Jess. Everyone's excited to finally meet you. Kim has already shared so much. That is Sunny. And Maya. Welcome to our humble retreat. I hope the walk here wasn't too difficult. Welcome. I understand it took some convincing, but we're so glad you came. Kim is a good friend to you, and that makes you a good friend to us. I'm sure you have many questions, but isn't that how our spiritual journey begins? Honestly, I'm, I'm not a very spiritual person. We're all here to support each other. Kim truly desires to heal the wounds, both hers and yours. Yeah, that's why I'm here too. It's just a bit intense. I understand. Why don't you get settled in? Get to know the others a little better before tonight's session. It smells amazing. What is it? It's my coriander leek soup. I do what I can to keep everyone healthy. Is there anything I can do to help? Hmm. I think I might be missing some ingredients for tonight's tea. Could you gather me some lavender, ginger root, and a spirit cap? I will forage away. I hear you're a developer. Hey, Jess, right? Y you probably heard about the Spirit Ember Festival I started. It was going to ignite change. But my dad and brother <laughs> pulled the plug and let everyone down. Check these out. Tyler and I are going to take my ideas and transform this island into something glorious. A true spiritual paradise. Amazing, right? Um... I know. I, I know it's a lot to take in. Just go watch my orientation video to learn all about it. It's near Tyler's dome. Open your mind to a whole new way of being. There's real, spiritual opportunity here. Prismic science is the key to profound realignment of your entire way of being. You may be asking, what is prismic science, and how does it work? Scientific and mathematical principles applied to spiritual growth in a way that gives real results. Do you want people in your life to understand your true value? Do you? That prismic science will help your light shine bright. I wasn't a spiritual guy, but when I began to understand prismic science, I found a key to profound realignment in my life's purpose. It changed my life, and it will change yours. Welcome to the Prismic Spiritual Retreat, and prepare for your life to never be the same.
Maybe I should Maya, do Maya, I think I have what you are looking for. Perfect. Just leave them on the counter. Wow. These are measured perfectly. Have you done this before? Actually, I work in biomedicine. I used to spend a lot of time doing field work, but lately it's boring desk work. I see. Don't they do animal testing? Doesn't that seem wrong? It is wrong, but my division won't listen to me. If people won't listen, maybe you're in the wrong place. There are many other types of medicine. I'll think on that. I really should get back to Kim. Jess, Tyler left some gifts inside for you. Try them on. Is this really necessary? As Tyler says, we have to trust the spiritual journey. Whatever Tyler says. Well, one size fits all. How do I look? Like one of us. Kim, doesn't this all feel a little bit culty? Don't be silly. This is good for us. Welcome. Come. Join us. Sit. Drink. As the sacred tea opens your third eye, you will sense the gloom pour forth from your very soul. Let it pour as a cloud of negative energy forms. This prism was a gift from my mother, as the ones you wear are my gift to you. The Chan charges the prism, tuning you into the energy that surrounds us all. Starting with Hannah, add your voice to the chant as we move around the circle. violently with all your negative energy prepare to destroy it with a collective chant Oh, it's you. Don't startle me like that. It's her own fault, okay? She broke the circle. After you drugged us? 
I didn't drug you. That tea is 100% organic. Everything is going wrong. I don't know what to do. What should I do? Just get out of my way. You do whatever you need to do, Jess. Whatever. Him? Help me! Help me! Hello. My name is Monroe Anton. Like young Babs here, you are now part of my family. With your help, we can all ascend our cosmic energy and be healed. I will provide you with the sacred wisdom of prismic science and the guidance on how to use it. By combining our individual frequencies, we can reprogram our destiny from gloom to glory. No, no, no. It wasn't my fault. It wasn't. No, my fault. Everyone blames me. <laughs> Kim? Are you okay? No! No, I'm not okay! No! Kim! No! Kim, what's happening? They're inside me! Go away. I'm so sorry, Kim! What happened to Kim? Are you okay? I had to. She was... She was possessed. Possessed? What do you mean, possessed? What did you do to her? She was attacking me. <sighs> we need help. Come. Help me carry her. What happened? This, this thing was controlling her and I... You smashed her face into a mirror. She wasn't possessed. You're psychotic. Tyler, I've been seeing things too, in the gloom. It's almost like what your mother said when... Do not tell me anything about my family. Do you understand? I'm sorry. I just... I'm sorry. <sighs> this is fucked up. I need time to think. It's all right. He gets like that sometimes. It doesn't mean anything. Can we get her to a hospital? No. The boat won't be here for days. So if all of this is real, the gloom, the creatures, what do we do? Kim messed up the ritual when she ran off. We have to complete the ritual to seal up the gloom to get Kim back. That makes sense. I mean, it's insane that any of this is happening, but it makes sense. Will Tyler agree to all of this? Don't worry about him. He'll listen to me. You get Sunny. I'll talk to Maya. Hello. My name is Monroe Anton, founder of Prismic Science. In the unlikely case of possession, follow these steps toward healthy rehabilitation. First, Burn away the attached mind eaters with purifying candle fire. Then render the patient unconscious so that they may meditate and recover from their ordeal. Through prismic science, we will transcend negativity and shape the universe from gloom to glory. But they mind them. That's it. That's it, 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 it's the mine. Sunny, thank God I found you. We need to reverse the ritual we started. 
What do you mean, reverse it? That ritual was proof that these prisms can manifest something new and powerful. These? There is power in each of them. And here down this trail is a crystal mine filled with them. You can't possibly think this is a good thing. We need to fix this or leave this island. I'm not leaving here. Those things can't hurt me or anybody else. They want to roam. And I will set them free. I've spoken to them. What have you heard? What have they told you? The truth! <sighs> I told Tyler you were going to bring bad energy to this place. Sonny, he ran up the hill. I don't think he's okay, and we need his prism. But Kim's still hurt, and I can't just leave her alone. It's all right. You look after Kim, I'll get Sonny back. Okay, just be careful. Take my flashlight. Welcome, children. You must be wondering why you were all here. Every one of you is special and has been selected based on your distinct frequency. But some of you, my children, have begun to act out at inappropriate times. And as a father, I must discipline my children when they misbehave. I love you all. But if any one of you interrupts or leaves a ritual while it is in progress, I will sling you over the shock stones. Prismic signs, we can channel that energy to become a positive force in the universe. Turn your gloom to glory. Sonny, what are you doing? You can't stop me, Jess. Just like you couldn't stop your own sister. Shut up! You're alone. Afraid. She drowned! <laughs> the crystals and the medicine, it's subtle, but I can see it. It's right here. It has to be here. Why are you here, Jess?
all I could see was my own pain. Where's Sonny? He's... The gloom got him. He's gone. Oh no. You can't tell Tyler. Not right now. It'll be too much. I got Sonny's prism. Will this be enough to help? No, I don't think so. We need everyone alive to complete the ritual. But Tyler said Monroe Anton used the lighthouse to control the gloom and those creatures. Who is Monroe Anton? I think it's Tyler's grandfather. Maya said that... Tyler would talk about his family in the lighthouse when they smoked a little too much. I'll ask her what she knows. Wait. Before you go. Take this. Maya found them while you were gone. If Tyler thinks this is real, he's been lying to us this whole time. Last night, I encountered another novel gloom creature. A crawling humanoid beast that I have labeled the Mimic Crawler. The Mimic Crawler's armored face opens up to reveal a beautiful flower. This flower is pollinated by parasitic creatures. Are there other means of pollination available to Mimic Crawlers? These findings suggest that they reproduce but not out of any instinct or desire of their own. Kim told us you lost your sister when you were younger. I'm out. Yeah. A ten-year-old. Trying to swim to the bottom of a lake. To find something that wasn't there. Why didn't you stop her? Kim and I were tanning on the beach. With our headphones in, we didn't hear her go in the water. Didn't hear her. <sighs> Calling for help. You were just girls. That's no excuse. We didn't think she would actually do it. I don't know who to blame more. Kim or myself. It doesn't matter. We should have known. Jess. You can't know what will happen. My son, Seva, we... I... didn't think a perfect child should be given an injection. When he got sick, I... blamed myself. 
because I listened. I listened to people who didn't know anything and ignored anyone who did. <sighs> I've done what I can to make peace with it. But I'd do anything just to hold him again. So that's why you're here. That's why we're all here. We'll save Kim, Jess. I promise we won't lose anyone else. I never should have come here. When Kim reached out, I thought this could help us both. Stupid. So what got you involved in all this? After Seva passed, I traveled through Southeast Asia to focus on my dancing. Oh, wow. Sunny approached me to dance at the Ember Festival. A shame that didn't go through. Sounds like Sunny was in over his head. He had a lot of pressure. This is nuts, but... He spoke to me in the gloom, after. Really? Did you see him? I just heard his voice, coming from those things. I don't know what's real. You think they're real? Real enough right now, that's for sure. But what if the gloom lets you see something you want? What do you mean? I don't know. I'm just getting weirded out by all of this, that's all. Did you see that? Seva? Maya? This can't be real. That can't be you. How did you get here? Maya, where are you going? I can see him. I can hear him calling for me. There's nobody there. It's the gloom lying to you. Don't listen to it. Maya, no, wait! Is that for a prism? I think so. I'll try mine. to align it. Turn the beacon. It's not moving. Let me have a look. This doesn't look like something we can just force. I'll look around. My name is Monroe Anton, founder of Prismic Science. The Prismic community we have created is transcending anything I could have hoped for. Our third eyes have been straining to glimpse through the veil of gloom for a long time now. But this is no veil. It's a locked door. And thanks to my, and my daughter's research, we now have the sacred key to this cosmic gate. A goal of prismic energy is to plant the seeds of fulfillment rather than delusion. Beyond gloom to glory.
anything. I'll be right there. to drown here too. Thank God you're back. How's Kim? No change. Where's Maya? She's gone. Oh, God. First Sunny, then Maya. We're gonna die too, aren't we? No. We are going to do whatever it takes to stay alive. You talk to Tyler? Can we do the ritual? Tyler's being so... He said his prism can be used to control the gloom. He said we have to use Monroe's mask, but what is that? And what do we do? He won't say, he just yells. I'll talk to him. Are you sure? You have to be careful how you approach him. He can be very sensitive. need to talk. Can't you see I'm trying to think? What do you want? Tyler, we need to recover your grandfather's mask. It's the only way to save Kim. Hannah, what did you tell her about my family? I told you never to speak of them. Hannah, why are you letting Jess run rampant like this? You're right. She's just a bit stressed. Don't worry about it. It's just been so crazy recently. Jess, see if you can find the prism. Where did Jess disappear to? Jess? She's actually trying to help. Her friend almost died. You were saying there's a lot of pressure on you. It must be really rough. Yeah, it is. It wasn't supposed to turn out like this. I'm sure you'll figure something out. You always do. Do you think Jess killed Sunny and Maya? Is she trying to undermine me? Is that what's going on? Tyler, please stop blaming Jess. She's the only one brave enough to do anything about this. Jess actually listens to me. She risked her life at the lighthouse. Really? That's... Good. All right. Maybe I misjudged Time to her. get out of here. She just needs your guidance, Tyler. We all do. Yeah, that's right. You both need to listen better. Tyler, those creatures we've been seeing, and the people with the masks, why aren't you afraid of them? They are avoiding me for some reason. Maybe it has to do with my family. It's my family legacy. 
I'm still trying to put together the pieces. Jess? What are you doing here? Where did you come from? Tyler, I'll be back soon. I promise. Jess, we should get going. Come with me. Where are you going? Hannah! Did you get the prism? Yeah, I have it. He's gonna be pissed. What now? We have to get the mask. It's at the old commune. The old commune? What's that? There used to be another group here. In the 70s, they lived in a commune. You know Tyler kept notes on everyone? Did the notes say anything about me? Yeah. Doormat and 1.2 million dollar trust fund. So, what is the story with you and Tyler? I was coming out of a messy breakup. Like, really ugly. Let <laughs> me pick up the pieces. At first, he was just a teacher, but then we just kind of clicked. He made me feel whole again. Is my prism doing this? Jess, Jess, I can't leave. Is there another way? It's called the Spirit Trail. Tyler said he came up this way to get the mask, but some creature drove him back. Just listen on your radio. I'll let you know when I get there. Hello, my name is Monroe Anton, founder of Prismic Science. Your connection to a prism and its purifying energy forms may be difficult to maintain. But with these masks, you can help stabilize and empower our connection through these sacred animals. So take this wonder of prismic science and truly become a child of the green prism. Transform gloom to glory. Hannah, we made it. I'm glad you're okay. Jess, I feel so stuck with Tyler. What should I do? Just walk away. You know what? I think I'll do just that. You ready to go find the mask? Yeah, I'm ready. So we got Tyler's prism, and we're getting the mask. And you think we can help Kim that way? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the prismic energy that has her in that state. With the mask, I think I can re-channel that energy. If you'd said that a few days ago, I'd say you were insane. This is it. The commune. Holy fuck. It's massive. Look at those buildings. You see the large dome over there? That's where we're going. The way down's over here. This used to be some sort of greenhouse. What did they grow? I think food, mostly. Pretty sure they grew psychedelics, too. Different kinds. Tyler used to come here to harvest them once in a while. Crazy how fast the plants have grown since the ritual. What do we do now? Look around to see if you can find anything useful. I'll check around here. <laughs> Jess, the plants are dissolving. It worked. The path is clear now. Hannah, you've been around for a while. I was wondering, how did Kim get involved in all of this? Same as everyone, I think. Tyler taught yoga. He used that to get inside her head. Did he do that to a lot of people? He's pretty good at it. There's probably another 50 or 100 people who think he's amazing. He didn't invite them all to the retreat, though. That's only for the inner circle. Those who were truly ready. Truly ready to be taken advantage of, more like. Sorry, I shouldn't say that. No, it's okay. It's true. We were all so eager to be included. He never stopped to think about what he was doing. Did you know about the gloom and the creatures? That, that they were real? Not at all. It was all about the prismic energy. Like, I wanted to believe, but I didn't think it was actually real. And look at us now. Yeah, here we are. Perfect. More gloom. I guess you'll have to see if you can find another way. I'll be fine, Hannah. Okay, let's both try to make our way to the large dome at the end. 
You must be wondering why you are all here. The time has finally come for me to step into the prismic dimension. Meditate on my passing into the cosmos as I form a sacred covenant with the gloom on your behalf. And know that your energies will soon follow my own into enlightened purity. Beyond gloom to glory. Jess, I'm glad you're here. The gloom, it was horrible. You gonna be okay, Hannah? I think so. What's the gloom like for you? Let's not talk about it. Yeah, let's not waste our energy. Anyways, we still have to find a way to get the mask. It should be through the door behind me. I just can't get it to budge. I'll figure it out. You just rest. Okay, but at least take my prism. You'll need it to access the other side of the commune. Thanks, Hannah. My research has led to a difficult realization. The negativity that surrounds us all cannot be extinguished. The gloom was not created from our negative energy. Our species was created to feed it. It is the only reason we survive. Their presence is not limited to this island. The gloom we've seen is only the tip of the cosmic iceberg. Cannot be escaped. My prismic science <coughs> still has hope. I have found a way to control it. This mask I have constructed harnesses a unique spectral code. My children may all die, but this is our only chance to transcend from gloom. belongs to me, to my family. Tyler, listen to me. It will destroy you. It'll destroy us. It's my right. You know that. We did this together. This isn't what we wanted. No. It's better. You said you needed me. I do. I need you to trust me. Babe. Come on. Take it. Turn to you. 
The prism begins anew. The light from the reflectors. That's how he controls them. If we turn them, they'll turn on him. I hope. Let's try. I see we have guests. Those two, kill them! going to save Kim. I know what to do. Does everything feel scary, Jess? Does it feel like you're drowning? That's great help. How are you feeling? I have such a headache. What happened? I hate to interrupt. Kim, I'm glad you're okay. But we don't have much time. Jess, I need your prism. It's a real mess. I'll explain later. I had such bad dreams. About Angie. About you. Do you really think you can destroy the gloom like this? Maya. Sunny. Tyler. What? I can bring them back from the other side. I know how to do it. Hannah, no! My whole life, nobody ever cared about me. They do. Instead of trying to stop it, we can all be together. Hannah, it's the gloom. You can't bring them back. Don't do it, Hannah, you'll... I'm sorry. But you'll soon see what I do. Kim, can you walk? We have to stop her. I'm too dizzy to walk. You go. I'll be okay.
and peace, Angie.